Hello, welcome to another Omniverse tutorial. In this tutorial, you will learn how to use the script editor. This tool provides a convenient way to edit and run scripts right in your Omniverse app without having to switch back and forth between an external text editor. Not only does it have the basic text editor functions like open, save, copy, and paste, but it also lets you execute your script in whole or just the selected parts. You can work on several scripts at the same time by adding tabs for editing and execution. One feature that's particularly useful is the snippets menu, which not only comes with some useful example scripts, but also lets you keep a library of your own frequently used code. Each Omniverse app can have their own snippet collection by editing the script editor's TOML file from the respective Omniverse app. The easiest way to find this file is to click on the edit button in the script editor's entry in the extension manager. Doing that will open the TOML configuration file in VS Code or your default text editor. Look for the Snippets folder array under the Settings table. You add the path to your snippets by adding it to the Snippets folder array like this. As noted in the Settings table, the first line of your Python file should be a comment with the name of your snippet and the category it belongs to separated with the forward slash. The category will be the submenu the snippet will be placed in. And here's the actual folder with the snippets. As you can see, this Python file contains the first line commented as mentioned previously, and then the code itself. Now you need to restart your Omniverse app, Omniverse code in this case. Go to the script editor window and click the snippets menu. As you can see, our newly defined category has been added as a submenu, which has an entry for our snippet. Now select our snippet and the code will be loaded into the script editor. Now before executing the entire script, notice that when we select a portion of the code, the run button's text changes to run selected. This will just execute the selected area and nothing else. Notice the output reflects executing just a selected portion of the script. And now I'll run the entire script. When a prim is selected, this script adds rigid body physics to the prim. So to see the effects in real time, I'll start the simulation and click on various prims and watch them go. Okay, not very useful, but it's a fun example for this demonstration. So now you should be up to speed with using the script editor and its convenient features. Thanks for watching this Omniverse tutorial. Happy scripting.